Prime Minister Edouard Philippe announced a total of 18 billion euros in public aid for the hotel and restaurant sector. An unprecedented plan, he called it, really emphasizing um, that tourism remains a national priority. You could really feel that the Prime Minister was trying to reassure the sector and empathize with them. He said he understood that they were the first to close and they're going to be the last to open. Um, on that note, though, we still don't have a ton of clarity regarding a date. Uh, the Prime Minister said that they are aiming to reopen restaurants in less um, impacted areas in France, these so-called green zones, starting on June 2nd. Um, but the prime minister said that they will confirm that on May 25th. They also hope on May 25th to actually give a date when restaurants in so-called red zones, like here in Paris, will actually um, be able to reopen for their part. Um, that's something that um, restaurant workers really, really want to know is just when they're going to be able to be open again. And so they're likely not going to be very satisfied by that announcement today that they still don't have a date. Um, the prime minister did make it very clear that in July and August, French people will be able to go on vacation within France, including in overseas departments, uh, which means that this 100 kilometer limit that we currently have is going to be lifted at least for those two months. Um, the Prime Minister also crucially made it clear that hotels and travel agencies are committed to reimbursing any cancellations that might happen to, occur, to, happen to occur due to the coronavirus. Um, so really, again, trying to reassure French people that if they start to make their vacation plans now, they don't have to worry about it. Whatever happens, they will be reimbursed. So really trying to kickstart those summer vacation plans.